Christmas shopping only because I'm like the worst at keeping surprises. And when I buy something for someone, I wanna tell them and I drop hints and ultimately they end up guessing what they're getting before they even unwrap it. I would definitely say wrapping gifts. Decorating cookies. <laughs> Taking family photos. All right, y'all, family picture time. Let's get gathered. Come on, come on. Act like you like each other. We all love each other. Brent, get rid of the Cheetos. Come on, join the family. Rid of them, come on. Okay, all right, let's, let's get in here. Um, actually, can I get the boys, all three of you, to surround them really quickly? Do not touch her white, beautiful hair with your Cheeto stain. You can go in front. Close, you love each other, your family. It's Christmas time. Presents are coming. Really good, so good. Chad, honestly, you're actually doing really good. You are the poster child. Brent, if you could look at him. Lucas, look how good he's doing. Look at that, just be inspired. No, not in an attitude. Man, putting up Christmas lights is so hard. You gotta take every little light and string it on up and then you gotta wrap the tree perfectly and you gotta set those little dolls up perfectly and if it's not perfect, then you get to do it all over again. I need a robot that will string those lights all the way up to the top and all the way back down and then it'll take them off. I would personally love to automate decorating the Christmas tree. Not because I don't enjoy putting up the bulbs, but the spacing. You have to make sure you get the right proportions from top to bottom. It's so crucial to a perfect tree. Hey Bjorn, see you're decorating the tree. Remember what we talked about? Like 10 to 12 ornaments per every foot of tree height and really six inches apart preferably and also the bigger bulbs to round out for framing the tree. I, I mean, I'm really not trying to tell you how you do your job or anything and super not type A, but um, yeah, just like keep it up. Good job. Keep it up. Great work. Yep. Okay. Awkward holiday parties. Hey Bjorn, what's up? Um, yeah, uh, <laughs> uh, man, winter time, right? It must be, must be nice weather for you. Probably right at home. Um, yeah, uh, I think I'm, I'm gonna go check out the chocolate fountain. I heard they used 72% Coco nibs. Okay. What do you even put in a spiked eggnog? I, I don't know if it's bourbon or whiskey or rum. It doesn't matter. I need somebody to automate it so I can just really enjoy it because it's so good.
One of the things that I dislike most about Christmas is having to return presents. You gotta take those giant boxes and the receipt. Where, where's the receipt? I don't know. You gotta take all that in and then you gotta wait in line for like five hours just to return the gift. Somebody needs to automate that. Amazon's pretty good, but Target, Walmart, they need to get it together. Christmas music everywhere I go. Having to put up the decorations after Christmas is over is never fun. Some things just can't be automated, but your systems can. Give the gift of automation with integrations from Venn.